you guys. So I'm doing a really quick uh, urine fertilization update because I did a lot more reading last night and I discovered that some people just don't use urine. Some people use urine mixed with wood ash. Urine has a lot of nitrogen in it which makes uh, the leaves and the plant itself grow and get nice and beautiful. But the wood ash adds potassium and phosphorus, which makes a better, well-rounded fertilizer, according to some people. So urine by itself has a ratio of NPK uh, 1112. With the wood ash, it becomes 1149. So I decided to add urine with wood ash into our urine fertilizer and control for the tomatillos and for the tomatoes. So, um, of course, I just planted these, put them out, and we got a hailstorm. But that's part of the deal, right? So you can see this one I just planted. It got beat to hell. These have been out for a couple days, and they're they're looking a lot better. But um, so that's why, also why this has a little ash on top, because I just put a little ash in. I collected some ash from the fireplace. I got my little scooper in there, my wood stove, so it's hardwood ash. And uh, we're going to continue this experiment just with that addition. So I wanted you to know what the NPK value was. And um, by the addition of the potassium and phosphorus with the wood ash, that's what allows the blooms and the fruit to set and to grow. Um, the nitrogen really affects the leaves of the plant, so urine only might be great for plants that are basically just leaves, Swiss chard, uh, kale, spinach, things like that. But those things with fruit or veg might benefit more from the wood ash. So anyway, we're going to add that into the mix and uh, see what happens. So that's your update for today. Thanks, you guys.